invisible boundaries, conveniently placed explosive barrels, and timed missions are a few things in video games that have become standard practice. So let's take a look at some of these redundancies with our list of the most common tropes in video games. Whether you're playing a stealth game or not, stealth missions are popular in many campaign games. These sneaky assignments are often brought on by your character either losing all their gear, becoming defenseless against enemies, or the enemies are simply too powerful to attack head on. Regardless of the reason, this trope challenges the player to change how they play the game. Love them or hate them, these missions are here to stay. You're a righteous hero that follows a moral code and has the weight of the world on your shoulders. So you can do whatever you want, right? Even a little legal breaking and entering? We at Squad aren't condoning this invasive pastime, but it's safe to say that video games don't shy away from it. Whether it's an NPC's home or a place of work, it's always the most convenient option games use to hide useful items. It's a good thing NPCs don't care about home invasions or damage to their property. video game characters are iconic for their appearance, and that's because they're always wearing the same thing. Be it a green tunic, blue pair of jeans, or bandana, we always find our heroes donning the same wardrobe even if the weather doesn't permit it. Traversing through a lava-filled castle? No worries, man's not hot. Characters dressed in the same garb may make it easier on the developers, but it's pretty unhygienic when you think about it. Have you ever played through a level with low ammo only to find a huge crate of supplies close to the end of that level? If you said yes, then you probably know a boss battle is just around the corner. One of the oldest features of level design, this trope is a way to give players the upper hand on impending fights against an enemy bigwig. The best part is, wherever you are, be it a dark lab or the depths of a jungle, the supply stash will be there for the taking. If you think about it, it's a pretty generous gesture from game developers. It's also a good reminder for us to save, so thanks! Often the main mission in stories, saving the princess or prince is one of the most overused tropes in video games. Usually, the character in distress is someone close to the protagonist and often has a poor sense of danger or is just plain stupid. Either way, they end up getting into a tense situation that forces the main character to go in guns blazing. This trope doesn't get old, and we know it usually ends well, but has anyone ever stopped to think that maybe the hero needs saving too?